peace love and light scorpios coming with another message as i speak i'm seeing three four and five the numbers three four and five for some of you this may be significant it may be your life path it may be uh date of birth i'm seeing those numbers may be significant for some of you or you're seeing them lately three 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 four 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 five 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 they may be coming in sequence. I'm seeing that might be significant. Messages for Scorpios. Oh. Mmm. Whoa. The Devil and the Eight of Swords. Someone. Huh. first thing that came to mind is like someone's someone's being someone's kind of like leaving an addiction that's one of the first things that came to mind someone seeing clearly where they may not have seen they were bound by something something was holding them down before that's not holding them down mm. um for some of you i'm seeing that there was someone that was surveilling you that had a very close eye on you or people people that had like you under surveillance for some of you and it's like that aspect of surveillance is no longer the case where it's like mm, you're being released or they're deciding to. They're deciding to back way back up. Seven of Cups. I'm seeing this may have to do with your dreams this may have to do with your dreams some dreams clarity mm. we gotta investigate this one yeah this one yeah the high priestess is the one that's gonna investigate this one This high priestess is going to be investigating this. Let's see what this seven. Uh, hmm, seven may be significant too for some of you. Tell me about this devil card. Hmm. Everything is in reverse. Everything is in reverse. Whoever it is, there's someone, there's someone that's being, it's like, it may be that the sun is illuminating something, is shedding light on something, is shedding light regarding someone, someone waking up, someone's beginning to see. Or they were not able to see. There was something that kept someone bound. Hmm. There was something that kept someone bound and unable to see. And in seeing that this pew, this pew, <laughs> this person may have refused to see. Someone. Who is this person? The devil card. Okay, high priest, high priestess. It could be a high priest or high priestess, someone. Someone who's balancing their options. Mm. 
Well, I'm seeing that there may be an earth sign in the picture. It may not be sign specific. There may be an earth sign that's beginning to have clarity about uh, some circumstance regarding you. And I'm actually seeing that this person, uh, this person may have been actually like, they were hired to do something is what I'm seeing. Like this person is really showing up, you know, as someone who was supposed to be on some kind of mission when it comes to you. They're showing up in reverse. They were given, someone may have been given an assignment or they were on some assignment as it relates to you. And they couldn't see, perhaps they were blinded or in, and or they chose to stay blinded. They refused to see the truth of who you are. They're beginning to see. This may have been someone that actually contemplated a relationship with you too. Uh, and I'm also seeing that this person initially didn't come for that particular reason. This is someone that actually I'm seeing that was like, it may have been, they may have been hired to sabotage something as it relates to you. Keep you distracted and it's like at some point they started they started contemplating something as it relates to you because they began seeing that whatever information they were given someone's realizing that they were given the wrong information about you that wrong information that they were given about you was meant to be the driving force that pushed this person to do ill towards you I'm seeing this is why they're showing up as the devil because this person may have been someone that was sought out because of just their nature. You know, perhaps there's an addiction. Perhaps there's there's something that someone had a hold on this person. And it's like, you know, since they had a hold on this person, they might as well kind of like use you as bait to get this person to do or did they use this person as bait they use this person as bait to get to you and this person ended up having a change of heart <laughs> ah, this person was supposed to be a bait they were they used this person as bait to get to you and they ended up having a change of heart they remain stuck. They chose to remain stuck for quite some time. And I'm seeing until recently. Um, this person starting to have a change of heart. Not that any of you for some of you. It doesn't even matter because you're nowhere to be found. Like maybe that you removed yourself from this person. Because you saw exactly what their mission was. You know whether they had a change of heart or they have a change of heart. Uh, for right now, I'm seeing for many of you, that's besides the case. Like, it's not even relevant for you. <laughs> uh, this person was a great actor. All right. And the divine is just letting you know that they were just being used as bait to get some kind of financial advantage from you. To get something from you. It may have to do with finances, money, stability, uh, some kind of investment relating to your security like this person you know they they really put an act they were this person was thrown in a situation that they it's like this person was the bait that was planted in the right place at the right time wherever they knew you would be there they ended up planting this this situation this scenario and the person that's showing up here you may have 
when you initially met, you may have actually seen that this person, like they could talk a good game. And that's not, that's not coincidental. This person was meant to be, you know, someone that could talk a good game because they were bait meant to, um, <laughs> I'm hearing clickbait. It's like clickbait. You know, you see this thing, this package that comes a certain way and it just like piques your interest. And it's like the minute you click on it, you feel like you were kind of like, uh, you know, you were swindled. Is that the word? You were... You know, somebody played you. Hmm. At some point, I'm also seeing that many of you uncovered that there were some, there may have been some issues with this person, dependency issues. Uh, that the divine is saying is not coincidental this person was chosen to be placed where they were at to wheel you in because this person had all kinds of like <laughs> they had all kinds of receipts that literally could be held against them and so there it was I keep seeing this word like for me, for some of you this person became part of a plan for, you know some kind of plan to sabotage you to sabotage your life to release something from you to take something from you for many of you your life source whatever keeps you going your stability like this person was supposed to sabotage that. And again, not that you actually even bother to care. This person is, uh, yeah, they wish. I'm always getting these scenarios where someone feels like they wish they could have, but it's like, it's showing up as being too late for them. Like. You know, you didn't have a change of heart before this person walked away from you. Before Scorpio walked away from you, you didn't you didn't think to change your circumstance. You didn't think to have a heart. Now you want to have a heart? Come on, man. Come on. Now that the person is no longer in your energy, that's when you realize how valuable they were to you. So you say after the ties have been severed you've had enough time to think you've had distance absence makes the heart grow fonder huh that's what they're saying absence makes the heart grow fonder now they they for this person you may have had some memories you know you may have had some celebrating together some happy times that you thought was real but it was all bs to them it was all part of their assignment <laughs> yeah they understood the assignment all right to the point where many of you like you at, at the beginning perhaps may not have like you you had no clue this person had you convinced until you began seeing that what you thought was the case is not the case. This person, I'm seeing that you started putting up a guard, like a shield of protection around you. Once you realize this person's purpose, like the reason why they came is to take everything you have, is to take your life force. For many of you, that was the case. There's something that you had that this person wanted. And once you realize that, it was just like, wait, nine of cups? Mm, mm, I'm gonna, you know, I'm gonna guard my heart. I'm gonna guard everything about me. In fact, 
you're going to get very little access to me from this point forward. So once you began opening your, up your eyes, it was a different story. You grew in maturity. You grew in spiritual maturity, many of you. And this is what allowed you to see who this person truly is. Their work was about, like, you were their assignment. Operation Takeover. Yep, Operation Takeover. So, this person didn't their assignment failed their plan to self-sabotage you failed their plan to take over failed I'm hearing also some of them were supposed to keep watch and lure you into the point where they have you in a commitment that you couldn't back out of. Watching you, stalking you, keeping a very close eye on you. As you move, they also move. And I'm hearing the whole time like they had their own agenda. They had their own plan they were trying to fulfill. Tell me about this Eight of Swords. So this Eight of Swords in reverse is this person realizing that they were dealing with a high priestess that's one priest priestess um this person may actually you know may have been someone who was highly intuitive as well and they used it for the wrong reasons they use it for the wrong reasons and with this eight of sword showing the way it is uh, i'm seeing that Whatever contract this person entered into, um, it's like they're breaking these contracts. As they're breaking their contracts, they're releasing themselves from some commitment, some something that made them feel bound, some bondage. Something that made them feel like they were bound. This four of pentacles. This is them releasing. Hmm. Six of wands. This person is being haunted by visions of you. Yep, especially in this high priestess. At this time, they're being haunted. It's like the blindfolds have been taken off of them. The blindfold was only meant to allow them to see you. Okay? And it's like seeing you, like, is the worst punishment that they could be experiencing at this time because they're being haunted by visions of you. This person is being haunted by visions of you this is what they see and i'm seeing that you have for many of you you're not lifting a finger that's not you oh yeah there this is what they're being haunted by there may be an earth sign in question again it may not be sign specific this person is seeing this they're seeing you they're seeing what you represent they're also it's like they're having flashbacks of everything they did 
And it's like your spiritual team is like kicking their butt at this time, letting them know, like, do you know who you were messing with? <sighs> kind of thing, kind of energy. All these secrets, this person had secrets. All right. For whatever reason, I'm not guided to touch this deck today. Scorpios, I'm not guided to touch that deck at all. Let's see what's going on with this. Hmm. Messages for Scorpio regarding this reading. This person is currently being haunted by visions of you. This is current. Whatever happened in the past is the past. This person is currently being haunted by visions of you. And when they see, when they look, this is who they see. They see a lot more than... than <laughs> Well, not that they, a lot more than they're supposed to. They they see a lot more of you. They see a lot more of who you are. Like it, it's whatever they may have thought about in the past. They're seeing a lot more. Let's see. 24. Okay. So I'm seeing. All right. Huh. This person is trying to stuff down their pain. They're trying to numb, ignore, avoid uh, something relating to their past. Hmm. The inner saboteur is clever. Seductive patterns of behavior block your path your power distractions addictions cravings unhealthy habits will not bring you your best uh, stop terrorizing yourself with broken promises of discipline instead choose devotion to your chosen pathway and the goddess declaration i have compassion for myself whenever i see this uh you know whenever the divine is talking about they're being hunted by visions of you. This is what they're seeing. You get to know this is what they're seeing. And as we speak, look what's on the bottom. And we just had a reading on them yesterday. Dumbala and Aida Wedo may have something to do with this. Look at that, the snake. I'm actually seeing that they're seeing you for exactly... <laughs> especially Dumbala and how many of you get to know that Dumbala is represented by the snake in Haitian Vodun okay and they they may be seeing exactly that and that's the vision that they're being haunted by because not, they're meant to okay they're meant to they're meant to see whose child you are they're meant to see that you know they need to take their pause and never again to think of putting their paws on you not even the thought of it so if they had a thought contemplation of even daring to think okay the thought of thinking of putting their paws on you that's what they're going to be met with okay as the child of Dumbala this is what they will see okay all right, Scorpios, if this message resonates, please like, comment, share, and subscribe. Until next time, love, peace, and divine light.